Oh, hello. We're here at Cape Spear, which I'm not certain about this, but I think is the most easterly point of Canada you can go. Now, the views here are beautiful. It's very wide. Not just the people who are also very wide, but it's very foggy today. Okay, you literally can't see anything. But presumably, if you could see something, it would look like this. Uh, so I did some lazy googling. Cape Spear happens to be the most easterly point in Canada and the most easterly point in all of North America. Um, apart from, no, I think in all of North America. I had some weird stuff on Wikipedia about Danish controlled Greenland. Whatever. This is the most easterly point. There's like a fog horn that keeps sounding off. There's some cliffs here. Greenland's not Well, that's, yeah, that's why I was like, whatever. How you doing? What's your, what's your ensemble today? Yeah, you've really goofed. Are those bare legs? And here it is. The edge of Canada. It's so chilly. Like, it's proper chilly. But it looks so neat. This, this is dangerous coastline, stay away. Gonna get off the path for a bit. And if you look far enough that way, you might see Ireland. Oh yeah, to add to the flavour, it started raining. So Cape Spear, like really pretty, probably prettier in, it's not saying summer, but this is summer, and more summer, the most summer that this ever gets. Maybe? So I have not had a chowder that has like bits of salmon in it. That's delicious. It's really, really nice. Um, yeah, really good chowder. Cheers, Mrs. Kitty. Cheers to you. Drinking the Naughty Boy Hose. How's it? I'm getting a lot of cars and some fence. There's some rowers out there, but I don't think they're visible. This is kind of, oh, this is the army. You wanted the army? Okay. Wow. That looks very serious. Well, the... Yeah, this but without the fence. You're very snippy, Waylon. How are you even snippy? You're just like, I'm getting the fence. Fence goes away. I'm now getting the buildings. There's fence back again. <laughs> Kitty just is Catherine. Really? Things can be those things. They don't have to remind you of other things. Are you sure? Because you are way long getting. Yeah, it really does remind me of around Arrow Town. I knew it. Oh, I really did. Oh, hey. So we're here down at Beaver. Is it Beaver Lake? Beaver Creek? Down at the home of the beavers. Yeah. This is a pretty cute place on the way back to Cape Spear which will be our second time that we're returning to the most easterly it's our point. first time returning to <laughs> There were three things we wanted to see here while we were in St. John's. One was puffins, one was a whale, and this is the final. It's an iceberg. Or is it still an iceberg? Pretty sure it's an iceberg, it doesn't look like a marshmallow. And do you think the icebreaker boat's coming to icebreak it? Yeah, you reckon? Yes. I'm glad we came back. It's so cool, it's so crispy. Yeah. I don't think the boat is icebreaking it. But it is. So beautiful. Kite. Way to go. And the cloud rolling over. Yeah. I just wish I had that. Mm. Whatever I did to this. Looks like, do you remember when we did Pirate Vinegar? Yeah. Dye the water green. Yeah. Like green and blue. Oh, sorry. The watercolor looks unreal. This here 
I do my hand holding thing. It's the first iceberg I've ever seen in real life. Which I think is quite poignant. Are you happy? Truly happy for once in your life? I the world. Well, I'm at least on top of St. John's New Newfound Newfoundland. It's like Finland and then you chuck a new on it for Newfoundland. So we can see a park, a memorial, a college. Here's the bigger view. And if this place sucks, you're the one who said we should stay here. Okay, yes, yeah, so we're staying at a uni dorm room, believe it or not. Oh. It's really hot. Okay, let's check it out. Like, it's literally student halls of residence. Alright, we're on the top floor. Room 515, I think. Which is, five ones are over here. According to this sign. Welcome to your first day at uni, Catherine. You've got your uni backpack on. You're all geared up. Oh, now let's check you it out. Give us your thoughts and feelings. I mean, I think the main thing that Catherine, you might be a little upset about is the shared bathroom. Yeah, but um, this four. That's true. We could for a sweet. We could do more. Whew, she is warm. Definitely warm. We're in the bathroom. Right, now we're here checking out Te Papa Tongarewa. Just kidding, we're checking out the rooms, which is the Newfoundland version. So let's check it out. The rooms are like a sort of provincial museum here. Right. It's a beautiful view. Courtney, I actually know how to play guitar. And it's like the story makes no sense. I definitely recommend coming here and checking it out. There's also a collection, uh, it's a museum, it's an art gallery, and some archives. About 10 bucks to get in. It closes at 5, so don't arrive maybe at 4 o'clock like ourselves.